Coach, uh, it's the beginning of a, of a new season. The preseason ha has already co concluded as you all look towards the home opener. What has been your evaluation so far of this roster uh, throughout this preseason? Well, we, we have a we have a good base, a good roster, and you know throughout the preseason, uh, it's a it's a very nice group again. Uh, when you have eleven guys repeating, uh, so it's it's a nice core where you have to um, you can count on them, and they know you very well. They know the the, the way we work. So it's been the process has been much has been much better throughout the preseason. We need to make sure that uh, we're ready uh, mentally, physically, and uh, we understand that you know we we need to start off. Uh, we try to we, we're gonna need to push because we have three games at home, and the fact that we have three games at home, it's uh, we need to make it an advantage. Uh, it's not an advantage until we play and we get the points. We have to make it an advantage, so we're going to try to focus on that uh, starting on Tuesday. We just finished the preseason, as you mentioned, and uh, this is a process now in, in the five days that we have uh, that we're going to try to prepare the first game in order for us to make sure that you know when, when we go on the field, the players have all the, the, the system, the tools, uh, for them to enjoy, but also to have the three points to win. You mentioned right now that, that you've established, you've carried over a, a, a certain foundation from last season to this season. At the end of preseason last season, you mentioned that uh, there was a lot of turnover in, going into 2022 because you didn't feel that those players were didn't fit into your long-term uh, system that you were that you were looking for. Uh, from that uh, core of players that have come over, what were the characteristics that made you and the, and the uh, coaching staff feel like they were a good fit for the long term? Well, they, they did a good job throughout the season. They were uh, improving their level, their commitment, and the, their mentality. And, and the fact that they like each other, that they behave each other, because we have some difficult moments, but throughout the season they started to get to know each other, to work well, and um, you know, and they wanted to stay here uh, because at the end the most important for us is who wants to stay here. Whoever wants to stay here, we're always gonna open the door and the possibilities to keep them here. The ones that aren't here is because they they wanted to leave, they wanted to go. So we're not gonna hold here anybody you know, by force. So they wanted to be here. If they're, they're repeating, it's because they wanted to be here. They wanted to come back here. And we're happy and pleased with that. And they were, they were working very well. They were doing very well. So it's easy to work with that type of player. And my final question, last season, uh, the, the team's uh, bit of rival, San Antonio FC, earned the, US, uh, the championship uh, of, of the season. What kind of uh, added pressure do, does that uh, give the uh, give uh, the front office, you as a coaching staff, or the players to to try to uh, go in and, and try to find a championship for this season? Well, for us, is we have to we understand, you know, they they won, uh, but now we we just need to focus on ourselves. We want to do well. Um, it, it, the most important is being a little bit more competitive and throughout the season being more, cons being more consistent in our results, in our level. If we do that, we're going to be able to get into the playoffs. We have done it the past two years, so we know how to do it, but we want to do it in a little bit better way in order for us to be able to approach to the playoffs, repeat, getting into the playoffs, but having some possibilities to move forward and to get all the way to the end. Thank you. Coach, do you feel, you just mentioned about getting to the playoffs last year, you, you, got, you got in there at the very end with the pieces that are coming back to experienced players. Do you feel like it's more reasonable this year for you guys to secure a spot earlier and to do it in a much more, I guess, less pressure type of situation? Yes, definitely. Definitely. It's something that, you know, it was good at the end, uh, the, the way we push. 
but we don't need to push that hard and that uh, leaving to leave it the, the qualification to the end. That's why we we feel like we have the possibility, and if we start we start off well, we're gonna be able to secure our possibilities to go into the playoff before, and we don't have to rush and suffer the pressure until the last game of the season. We have five days, which is a good amount of days in order for us to prepare, and we we'll see what happened on Sunday. It's, a, it's the, the season opener. It's important for us to start well in front of our fans, uh, and they are already being you know, uh, comfortable the fact that the team has done it well the past two years. So. Uh, we have that pressure, but we love that pressure. We want more pressure because we, we want all of them to be happy and we want them all around here with us because it is, it is very nice to have this uh, stadium uh, full of fans. Mm -hmm. Who are some of the individual players that have stood out to you in your preseason friendly so far? To be honest with you, uh, all of them, they've, they've been very good. They've been very good. They've been working hard. It's a, uh, wonderful surprises, not only the way they work, but the way they've been adapting and uh, the kind of persons they, they are because, uh, you know, the locker room is pretty good. It's pretty fun. They, they like each other. And um, that's, that is important in order for us to, to deal with tough situations because throughout the season we know that you know when you win everyone is happy everyone is looks good everyone loves it, loves each other but when you lose is when you have to have that support that maturity so uh, that is that is uh, that is important to have that mentality in the locker room and uh, any message for the fans as they get ready to come watch you guys for the first few weeks here yes we want them to to understand that you know uh, uh, we know how important it is, is to have here uh, uh, the, the team winning at home, being solid, playing well, and giving some be uh, nice flair of soccer because, you know, the heritage. Most of the people coming from, from the Mexican heritage, they like to play well. They like teams to play well. And we understand that. And we have a good base good mix and we know that uh, also for us playing well is the best possibility to win games so we're going to try to continue that legacy that philosophy